live. Okay. All right, it's, I see it now on YouTube. Okay, just took a minute to get started. Yeah. I don't know why the words are across it, but. I see you and me. Okay, can you, did you see my, I said, can you see me? Did it, did it show up? Yeah, and it's showing up on the screen and not on the private chat in the middle over the okay. chat. That's Let's see. Uh, yeah, it's just showing me and not you. Or you and not me, Lord. I got both of us on there, and then I've got a screenshot of me of a, a thing, but I don't think it, it has to stay there, hide it. Okay. Yeah, you, I'm not showing for them. Okay. You on YouTube. There you go. Now I'm showing. Okay. Phew. How about, okay. how about now? There how about we go. Now? We got it. Now I'm going to do mute your YouTube. Make sure you're muted. Okay, that way there's no. Woohoo! I don't know why chat's not showing up on StreamYard. Like the last time I was able to watch chat on StreamYard, but I don't know why I can't. It's up now. You can't see it now? Well, yeah. now I can see it. I just can't see chat on the stream yard. I'm gonna watch the chat on your YouTube channel. Okay, on the on your iPad or phone. Or yeah. Whatever. Okay. Good. 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 Sorry for the delay. Yeah, it's a learn. It's a learning curve. And I still don't know what I did or how I got there. <laughs> no, no. I just clicked until it happened. Okay. What's wrong with Mindy? Okay. Oh, it's Debbie. Oh, I'm sorry. That's right. Debbie had the eye surgery today. Yeah. Is this is this the other eye? It's the same eye. I'm hearing myself twice. I am too. I, I think it might be. Hold on. I'm going to mute myself. Mute your YouTube. Did you get the little bookie done that we did? Yes. Well, I didn't do anything to it, but yeah. Uh, did you figure out you just had to turn it over one time? To get to the other side no, actually i tried making a second one and i screwed it up so i think i just got lucky i still have to hear an echo yeah do you have your channel muted on your end yeah your youtube channel is muted or may i need to mute stream yard then okay how do i how do i how about now Okay, because I muted your YouTube channel. Okay, uh, I can mute. I don't know how to do that. Just go on your YouTube. Are you watching from your chat for your YouTube? Yeah. Well, there's a little mic uh, volume thing next to pause and down from pause and play. Yeah. Well, there's a little mic uh, volume thing next to pause and down from pause and play. Yeah. No, I need help.
Hello. I'm fine. I'm streaming. <laughs> yeah. We do. We're early today. So can I call you back? Okay. I'll call you after a while. Okay. Well, I don't I don't know where to look for it. Um uh the volume on I don't know how to show it to you. Uh, it's just on the bottom of your YouTube screen. I mean, you when there you, it is. here it is. You there's like a line to go through it. Mine is muted. Can you hear it now? Okay. I think that's it. I think I did it. There you go. Gotcha. Thanks, guys. Details, details. <laughs> okay. So now we just need to find Kathy. I haven't seen her yet. I did email her that. Did you go to that email? I did. Okay. So that was good. I knew how to do that much. Okay. I sent her an email then. And now I just have to find my, I have to find my cow. We got to put llama larry next to the cow <laughs> my uh joe when joe worked uh he had a guy that had a llama farm and they called him llama larry and uh so i don't know that just sort of come out llama larry now where's my book here it is <clears throat> So here's the cow. Here's Lily. The only downside this arrangement, I can't get like everything on the screen. Thanks, Mindy. Where do I need to go? I need to move up. So I'm going to get to a new page and we'll get the other one drawn. So how there many of y'all? Oh, good. Okay. Um, how many of y'all are going to paint along? Going to paint along with us tonight? Do we have any takers? <laughs> are we going to be the the uh, the guinea pigs. <laughs> what colors? Okay, I'll tell you the colors. I'll tell you the colors. Kathy got us making these little bookies today, and I made like four of them. Dang. Uh -huh. I did. I made a baby one. I made a baby one. I made one and a failed attempt on another one because I'm not understanding the folding. The, the, well, the, the I, folding. I think you've got it. You just were opening it up on the wrong side. So the the, the, the part that you want on the outside. Like you want a single sheet. A single sheet on the outside. But if you open it from the other end of the, of the edges, you get five pages. Those are the five pages that you had gotten. But if you turn it over and open it from the other pages, you get nine. And the two on the end are singles. Well, some of them I was getting like it was wouldn't even open right. Right. That's because you were at you were at this side and not this side. You were at the spine. The spine opens up and there's like three or four together. And and they're 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 um, they're glued together funny, they're together funny, but and there's only like five, so you get you get like this kind of a split. So that's the spine, and then if you go to the other end, the other side, to the right side or the opposite side, you'll open up and you will get nine pages, and then you have to glue some of them together before it's over. Well, I figured. I got, I figured that out 
the second book I made, I just really screwed it up. I just threw it away. <laughs> I just got mad and I just threw it away. Well, I think I think I think you just got the end. You were over trying the, the wrong end, and I, <laughs> I really think that that's all it was for you. So, hi everybody coming in. Hello, okay. hello. I'm gonna get, get that point so we can go through the fold here. Here is the uh, color palette. We've got light pink, dark pink, light purple, dark purple, uh, dark green, lime green, and yellow. Those are the six colors. And then when we get into these colors, you can mix and and tweak them if you want it a little bit lighter or darker. All you need to do is add a little bit of white. So I would add white to your palette. Um, let's see what I can find here. Oh, great. Now that we said the 12 by 12 can make it more confusing. Oh. That's all. That, that's all I need. I mean, okay. I like it because it's double sided, and I don't have to like have one blank side. I don't know. I can cut the straight line because I can't see okay. it. So I'm going to get my paints out and you don't need a whole lot of paint. I always put out too much. All right. So I have my W. Okay. So she folded the W down. Then, uh, then up to where you have this. Okay, let me let I, I'm not trying to um, disrespect the way Kathy taught told you to do it. I'm just going to show you um, just another way, just just for giggles. Okay. Okay. And we're going to go to one end. Open it up, and it's an M. It's an M, M in front of me. It looks like a letter M. Just lay it flat. <laughs> okay, letter M. And okay. put the green, put the green side up. Put the green side up. And I've got blue. Okay. Okay. Now we can reverse this later. But right now we're going to go to the go to the left to this very bottom square. This one right here, mm -hmm. and fold it up. Well, my the, my the, the very first square folded up on your left. The other left. Left. Sorry, I'm looking in camera. Okay, left. Okay. Okay, fold it up. Now fold it back under. Now fold it under. There you go. That's fine. Now fold it under. Under again. Under. Now on. Fold it back up. Back up towards the back. Okay. Okay. And then we're going to go under again, to the right. Under. Okay. No. No. Okay. That's fine. You're fine. You're fine. Now fold that under. To the back, no, back under. <laughs> okay, open it back up. We're fine. Open it oh. back up. Open it back up. Okay, I gotta watch your stream yard to make mistake of watching from YouTube. I know. Okay, I know. go ahead. We do have a delay. It's okay. Now we're gonna fold it up. Fold it on top. Okay. 
fold it on this one little square in the corner fold it up oh fold it oh up up yeah that's it that's it now we're going to fold it under to the back no under we're not going this way we're going the other way go under to the back that's it that's it perfect now we're going to go back up towards the back no 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 you got it that's right good 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 great now we're going to fold it under to the right under under and make a you make a turn to the right under perfect perfect now we're going to go on top towards you on top folded on top towards you on top mm -hmm. on top perfect okay then we're going to fold it under toward fold it under 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 good 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 then we're going to fold it on top towards you towards towards good 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 now we're going to go to the right and we're going to go under to the right under to the right perfect under to the right Oh crap. You got it. You got this. Under to the right. We're going under. 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 We're not going to go on top. Just go under. Under. Perfect. Now we're going to go on top back to the back. On top to the back. That's right. You got it. To the back. Fold back. That's it. Now fold under. Fold under. Take the whole batch and fold it under. Good, 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 good. Now on top, fold back. On top, fold back. Fold it all back. Take the whole block and fold it back. Good, 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 good. Now we're going to go to the right again and we're going to fold under, fold under, you got this, fold under the whole block, under, good. Now we're going to fold it towards you to the front and fold on top, take it all forward, take the whole block forward, forward. Now under the whole block under forward and under and then the the last one goes on top. The last one goes on top. That's right. Now I want you to get you a piece of tape. Get your piece of washi tape any color just a piece of washi tape don't no 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 keep it together get you a piece of washi tape right now and i want to teach you something okay hold on yep just a piece of tape any kind of tape just a little piece of tape hang on guys we're Colleen's got to figure out how to work this little book. <laughs> oh, okay, Debbie. Well, there is a delay. I do know that there is a delay. So this tape seemed perfect. Okay. So this I know is uh well it says uh 
Love, joy, peace, and patience. <laughs> careful what you pray for. Careful Be patient. What you pray for. Be careful. Be careful. Okay. Just need one piece, one piece of tape. I don't care what size. Okay. I don't care what color. Just want one piece of tape. Now. <laughs> does this does your first piece fold up like this? Yes. Okay. Then right here, right here, I want you to put your tape down halfway. This is your spine. This is your spine. Close it. Now put your tape on this side and fold it back. Good. You can trim your tails off if you want. You can trim those off if you want. Trim your tails. Yeah. Oh, do this and then start gluing. Now, now what I want you to do is your first page, open your book like a book and your first page is single yep okay and then your next page is doubled and that that could be glued or used as a pocket okay oh so if you glue the bottom it could be a pocket good and then the next one it it has a split in it the next turn the next page and you have a little split right yeah so this too can be either taped or glued, and you could have a side pocket. Oh. Okay, you just glue the bottom or tape the bottom. Yeah, and then have a side pocket. And then the next page, it opens and it has, it 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 opens up in the middle, and you you can glue the bottom and have another top pocket. And the, and this is the I think the middle of the book or close to the middle. Of the yeah. Book okay okay and same thing with the other side you've got a couple of splits some way or another you can either glue those pages together or make you little pockets and until you get it taped or glued secured it'll be kind of delicate until you get that done then you can decorate the front and the back to whatever color you want it to be or or if you want to redecorate your book okay cool and that that was the easiest way i could teach it to you that makes sense and I think that's a little easier to understand and you can you can you know you have choices to add to it you see by making little pockets yeah i like the little pocket idea that's neat all right now back to our llama <laughs> thank you <laughs> Mindy uh, earlier said she had trouble um, with the folding too, but she wasn't uh, I guess, saying anything. <laughs> I didn't know she was there. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. Thank you, Dar. All right. Now I'm going to sketch my llama out. I don't have mine sketched out yet, but um, Colleen's got hers already sketched out. And I started my, uh, my paint. I can get some more of my paint out. Hi, Joe. Joe's here for what, baby? Hi, Joe. Hi, how are you? Oh, Joe brought me a present. <laughs> never know you might need a rubber band <laughs> I 
you can use those for uh, uh, mail together. <laughs> Happy mail. <laughs> Happy mail. I got him at the post office. Oh, uh, that's where he took all my mail to the post office this morning. Oh, uh, okay. I sent out happy mail today. And I sent out Brittany's real good. It was really good at the top of Brittany. And I got her book today too. I'll have to show you. Mm -hmm. So who all for King the Lama? Do you want me to do dark so you can see? Do you want me to do it? I do it. 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 Okay. Let me see if I can find it. Let me see if I can find it. I added her back. Okay. Wow, why did this crap this happen? I don't I didn't touch it. I'm not even on the big computer. Yeah, no, I didn't either. It was just wet. It was really weird. I was just sitting here too and I'm like, poof, I'm gone. That was so weird. I and got her back. I don't know what happened. Joe didn't touch it. He did not. I didn't touch either. It. <laughs> <laughs> it in the internet. <laughs> I don't know. All right, we won't worry about it. I'm back. I have no idea what happened. <laughs> um, does That's anybody true. know how to get a hold of Kathy? I don't actually have her number or anything. We could we could tweet her. Oh yeah, I did get my tweet up today. Oh good, thank you, Debbie. <laughs> Oh, did Debbie tweet her? Okay. She said it's normal now. Let me tweet her. I sound like I'm in a hole. I still hear an echo. And it's coming through my speaker. So I'm thinking it. Will you check? She said that she will um, she end up in a meeting with her. Meeting up her with her husband for dinner and she will not be here. Okay. Okay. Um, could you check your devices again and make sure you don't have your phone or your iPad on volume? Okay, Jeannie. Can you see what I'm doing? Am I doing it dark enough so you can see it? Okay, this is about the best thing I could tell you to do. I'm just sketching it by hand. I'm not doing anything special, except I'm just doing what I see. You sound like you got a double microphone. Well, I, th I think it's coming from that speaker. I don't think it's coming from us. I've already got my, I've already checked my speaker. This is off. This is on. Okay. Then hit. No, no, no. I'll do it. How does that sound? That sounds better to me. How does that sound? Nope, nope. I still hear an echo. That sounds better to me. How does that sound? I'm on mute, nope, so you need to remute on YouTube. 
I don't, I don't know uh, what to do. I don't, I don't know uh, what to do. Now, if I turn my iPad off, I can't hear anybody. If I turn my computer on, I can hear Colleen, but I hear an echo. I've got my YouTube box on mute. I can hear Colleen, but I hear an echo. I've got my YouTube box on mute. <laughs> okay, Colleen needs to move her llama up a little higher. There you go. Colleen, you're on mute. Can you unmute yourself? I didn't. Oh, well, you went in front of my bedroom and get my earbuds. Yeah. I'm going to get my earbuds. Okay, Janet, thank you. Okay, Janet. Thank you. There, yeah, that's better, Colleen. She unmuted herself. So I'm gonna put my earbud in, and then. Okay. How about that? Colleen, say something. I'm just trying to minimize the echo. So I'm not talking. I think I I think I saw I put my earbuds in. Okay. I am the echo. I guess. Okay, uh, I'm I'm drawing my llama. Okay, um, <laughs> the echo is gone. Okay. Okay, Kimberly's got a kangaroo going on. Okay. <laughs> Happy Ray Crafting Sunshine's in the room. Hello, been lurking. Come and paint along with this. Okay, I, who else needs some help with their drawing?
Colleen, how are you doing, honey? I'm searching She's hunting for something. <laughs> searching for paint because <laughs> uh, I'm looking at it a little more closely and I don't know how to make purple. Okay. So I'm going to just put down purple. Oh, purple is red and blue. Oh. Purple is red and blue. I'm like, I don't know how to make purple. I just put purple down. Okay. <laughs> red and blue make purple oh i do i love to make colors oh, do not like to make colors that's one of my hobbies <laughs> will you go get me a paper plate a styrofoam paper plate mm -hmm. or actually bring me two three joe's joe's gonna be my my paint boy he's gonna go after me some plates Have <laughs> you just put that in? <laughs> Red and blue make purple. <laughs> we'll help you. I'll help you. Fear yeah, not. TD's with me. She said she Does, prefers, um, prefers fixed. Prefers fixed already. Does anybody want to a look at this? This is out of the book. I did okay. She chooses a light dull green for the background, dark violet for the darkest values. Make it look more expressive. I use values of a uh, dull green with a large flat brush. So I got I it. Paint, so I got an eraser. Uh, mix it with some white. This is so. my eraser. <laughs> my bad. Yeah. Just because my eyes not right. <laughs> Colleen, yours looks nice, honey. <laughs> Thank Just you. It. Colleen looks good. Okay. He said my eyes were off. The eyes were hard to make. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, I'm going to show you in the book. This is what the finished llama is going to look like. This is the sketch. And the next the next one is this one. So we get to do the background, light and dark. I'm going to do the background first. And then we paint a few highlights in the face. Yeah. I think last time we and, did the face and then first. We, and then in the next step, we... we we darken it. We darken them. And then we start then we start modeling the back of the ground and then and then as we progress to the end it gets darker and darker till it's real real bright. And we start doing these little highlight things and extra little details. So it'll it's going to go from here, from this one to this one. So there's a lot of 
layers eventually so this is what i like about the book it shows you each page and each step and it and it's it's by pictures So I'm gonna do this now. I'm gonna do this one now. Gone rogue. <laughs> and this is the beginning of the Thanks for sharing the book. I can't fit it on my screen. So you all can sort of see. Any if you have any questions. Uh Type them in caps for us so we can see it. And I'll do my do our best to answer any of your questions. <laughs> yeah, Kimberly, give us detail. <laughs> okay, Colleen. Yeah. Are you uh, are you ready for some purple? I'm doing my background first. I'm gonna do it the opposite way as last time we did that. I'm gonna do my background. You wanna first. watch me make purple? I will watch you make purple. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of blue down. Mm -hmm. And now I'm going to put a little bit of red apple. <laughs> and all of my craft paints are none of a match. None of my paints match. I was laughing because Jeannie, Jeannie said uh, her husband's going to call it a drama llama. <laughs> Drama Llama. Can you see it? I see mostly red. Is it turning purple? Okay. Can you see the purple? Yes, beginning of it, yes. So depending what color red and blue you mix, you could get a funky purple. Okay. True, true. And you can add a little more blue if you want a little bit more darker. Can you tell now? Yeah, it's grapey. <laughs> yep, I can tell now. It's very grapey. Okay, there's your purple. <laughs> You're the drama mama. I like the light green, the dark green, the white. I do like that. <laughs> I like the multitudes here. You go to <laughs> Dar's got stickers, and she says they're stickers of llama, and they say no problem, llama. Perfect. No problem, drama llama. How about that? <laughs> I mean, things can be rhyme. This is fun. I 
Kathy chose her husband over us. What are we going to do with her? <laughs> well, all right. I won't get mad at her for that. I am just hassling. She doesn't just hassling her. Maybe she'll come in when she gets in. I tried to get somebody else to come in on us, but nobody volunteered. It's still not too late. Oh, who else has a camera? Debbie, Debbie wants to know what you're going to name your llama, Colleen. Hmm. This llama can't fold. So, I don't know. <laughs> Date night at the birds. <laughs> more camera people, don't we? Yeah. I still don't know how I got on here, so I just clicked until it worked. It's pretty, it's pretty user friendly, so they were smart when they made this. They made it easy to easy to figure out user friendly so which they were thinking about the thinking about that i think when they created this which a lot of companies don't i did get my my name up there now i'm not craft <laughs> <laughs> It said title, and I thought it meant the title of the stream, you know, what you want to call it. Hi, hey, Cheryl. So I put craft. But anyway. Oh, you're modding. And, oh, Vicky's streaming right now? I forgot. Thank you. I told everybody to go over there and, and say hi. You still have time to go over there for just a few minutes. They can not do the, the, I, I, open two screens and be bought between the two. I've done that before. So I don't want to miss. I don't want to miss either. And she uh, she showed off her um, over the moon book. I'm not familiar with that, what that is. Before we get it. on. It's a baby book. Baby, her kids? Her, um, her daughter, daughter's best friend is having a baby. Oh, okay, okay. And so she's making that for her. She got she it. Lost her daughter. But she oh. lost her daughter a while back. Oh. That's right. That's, that's terrible. Oh, and so she's kind of so she that's could, her daughter's friends. So she, she was invited to the baby shower, but she didn't want to go. Oh. Yes. 
so she made the baby a the baby's first junk journal <laughs> for her to write in and he he'll get it when he becomes an adult oh, she gets to write in it and Kat says her llama had the bumps, so she had to. Uh, the journal is very interesting. It has a background. <laughs> oh no! The llama had the bumps. <laughs> That's okay. No, the journal belonged to another person. It's an antique. So how did her llama mama got a got the mumps? <laughs> it looks like he's wearing no. a sweatband. <laughs> so he's like an eighties eighties llama. But you fixed him. Oh, okay, Cindy fixed him. Hi, Cindy. Oh, Cindy's playing too. Kim, Kim, Kimberly's making her llama, and he looks like he's wearing a hat, a sweatband. Uh, Zumba llama. I like it. Let's get physical llama, <laughs> Debbie. <laughs> well, that would be the 80s thing. <laughs> Olivia. Olivia, yep. Which one? I don't know which one is better. Okay, the house the llama. We haven't gotten that far yet. <laughs> All right, I'm done with my background. So I'm going to move on to the neck. Oh, gee, I had a mat. Maybe some black in there, too. <laughs> She's moving on. You're already on the purple. Well, just just a little coat. I like my background up a little bit. Um, Don't looking. Debbie likes to wait and see what our mistakes are, so then she doesn't make those mistakes. <laughs> right, Debbie? It's not the eye surgery. <laughs> she waits to see how ours turns out first and she knows what not to do. I am, uh, I'm not an artist at all. I'm just a crafter. And I haven't had any, any classes at all. Everything I do, I'm just self-taught.
I watch people and that's that's it. I've done painting with the twist. Does that count as a class? Painting with the twist. I never heard of that one. That's where you all, you go to a big lobby and there's like 30 people painting the same picture and you'd sit there and drink wine and paint. <laughs> Who the heck is that at? That that in Florida? Daytona Beach. Oh, it's I called painting with a twist. Oh, twist the lime. Say that would not be here. <laughs> what are you talking? They got them all over down here, different different paint places. Really? At the restaurants, they paint. There. Yeah. You should you should have them up in Cincinnati. <laughs> I was going. We are not so. Uh, I was going to ask you, Colleen. Do you know any Jack? Do you know any Jacksons? Nope. Cause you know my brother lives up there yeah i don't know i don't know i think i told you yeah who knows you could walk by his house and not even know <laughs> They have them in Cincinnati? Really, Kat? Where is this? I barely I don't get out there much. I bet they do. They're everywhere. Never heard of this. Maybe you need to go on a date night. <laughs> Would Tom go for it? No. <laughs> no. Arlene says she has watched them all around the world and they are on YouTube. Yep. I don't get out much then. <laughs> We've got a paintorama, painting with the twist. We even have a Bob Ross studio down here. You can go paint Bob Ross's. Wow, I didn't know that was such an artsy area down there. He's oils, though. Well, Bob Ross is from down here. Oh. He's, he still has his family studio. I didn't know that. The grandkids run it. Oh, wow. When... When you go in to that paint class, it's of course it's oils, and they paint you, and they and it's in their contract that they have to say you have a happy day. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know he's always painting happy trees. Yeah, I think it's by I think it's in their contract that they have to say it. <laughs> okay, how's everybody doing? How's everybody painting? Nettie's in the house. Hers is a much darker purple. Give me my second coat, Bobby. Yeah, Cindy, those painting classes, you can get online and get on their website and see what pictures that are have available 
and you can pick which paint you want to paint. painting and which night it's on they have prices and everything on there I already got the rooster sketched in this book. Oh, really? Yeah. I had so much trouble um, trying to sketch his um, the rooster head. I kept making his head too big. And um, I tried, I tried, I was so frustrated and I felt like I did the body really good but I couldn't get I couldn't get his head right and Tom's like you're making his head too big and I knew it looked weird and and then um and she she shows using the grid stuff and I did not use a grid thinking I don't need that grid yeah I did you know she once I got to the head I did I was struggling and he finished, he drew the head for me. <laughs> so I was making the head humongous. And I was like, that's why my, my rooster looks so weird. I kept my, trying to make his head too big. That's fine. So he actually can paint. So can oh if he wanted to. See, I'll show you that later. Yeah, so I did the rooster already. And he did the rooster head. And I did the rooster body. He's like, next time, do the grid. Do you like she said? <laughs> like, I'm sorry, I've never drawn. I've never done a rooster before. But he hadn't either, and he knew his head was too big somehow. So, kudos to him. Really? Okay, Patricia, she said she's gone AFK for a while. What size is your book? Uh, I think it's uh, 11 by 14. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. That's right. There's XL media books. Okay. Mixed media books. All right. Okay, that, that's right. And mine is smaller. Okay. Doing weird purples. Yep. Are you doing working on yours, Joycey? Jeannie's doing 10 by 7. Oh, okay. Hers is really small. Okay. See, that's the thing. Like, depending on the size notebook you're putting it on, it's going to look slightly different than others, than uh, other people's because of the size book. Joyce is painting along. And she doesn't actually. Okay. Oh, good. I'm glad you're playing along, Joycey. 
because she doesn't actually specify for these what size she uses. Now the chicken she does. But for the um, rest of these, she doesn't specify what size um, thing she used. And the chicken was, I think, 11 by 14. Okay. Now, what I gotta do? Did that part. Ooh, his eyes are gonna be purple. Yep. His nose. Well, it starts out that way. I don't know how they're going. Yeah. Up. His nose, his eyes. Maybe a little lighter purple. I'm starting out with light purple, and I think I'll darken them up as we go. So it goes here, 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 here. Piece wipes in the middle. Here, here, here. Under his eye. And his eyes. had some much needed rain this afternoon. I was very glad. Dogs were not. They don't like thunderstorms. Abby doesn't either. Oh, yeah, I Freak out. White later. Maybe a light purple nose. Okay. 
Alright, I need some pink. And some yellow. If anyone um, needs me or her to hold up um, the book to see the photo, if you're working along, let us know. <laughs> My, they're saying I have a rainbow llama. My llama looks like he's getting ready to have a, a war party or something. <laughs> He's a party animal. Don't get too close. He'll spit on you. <laughs> That would be so gross. Okay. This needs to be darker. Oh, Cindy would like the book held up. Okay. Do you want to see, Cindy, do you want to see the next? So this is where, this is the face that Beth is on. Or where I'm starting at. Oh, I'm too close. Sorry. I'm not used to streaming on a half of, uh, half of screen, so I'm not holding stuff up right. Okay. Uh, I can give you the whole screen for a little while. Would you like that? Oh, no, I don't. I just don't. But is there a different configuration to the screen, like a uh, one on top of the other or something? Oh, you took a picture? Oh, good. Okay. Because here's the finished. That might be a little bit better. Okay. Yeah, because that way I can get. Is that, is that any better? There. This is the finished llama I'm laying down here. So, if, yeah, if you want to take a screenshot. Okay. The finished guy, because that's what we're working towards. But, like, there, she's having us build up the layers. And then we're going to add all these little details later, like the little um, hairs, the highlights. All right, let's go with that. I'm gonna go with the pink. He's a pretty llama. I'm gonna be a llama. I'm gonna be a pink one. Purple.
It's so neat when you get done with these and you have a completed, you know, a completed painting. It's It feels good, you know? You can look at that and be like, I did that. I did that, you know? It's like, it's so cool. It it's does. Itself. It's a good feeling of accomplishment. You can yeah. look at that and you, you think, it looks so good and I did that, you know? And I think that's the fun part about this book is it you you know you completed a really neat painting all by yourself yeah you know, stuff that you look at on you know instagram you made yourself which is really neat yeah for sure I want to get back into that other book too. That fast and easy book that we have. Oh, the yeah, I have not. Uh, Debbie, I think, has done all of them and more in hers. I have not completed all of them. I did almost all of them, but not quite. That's true. We could do that sometime because I have not finished that either. It's a lot of good projects in that. That's a fun one because it's watercolor and acrylic. I'm just, I'd like to do the one we did. I did the, uh, with the sailboat. Oh, that one was fun with the paper sailboat. Yeah. Yep. I loved it. I want to do it again. <laughs> Can't release it. Someone will look at her llama and say, "Bless his heart." Kind of when I sketched it out, I kind of like design, I kind of uh, pre penciled in kind of where some of the paint was going to go based on the finished painting. Well, you can, you can, uh, we've been posting like, are, are you on the Facebook group, Sherry? We've been posting it, uh, pictures so that everyone can um, use those photos to play along if you don't have the book. Like I posted um, a picture of the llama drawing. Amazon has them, Sherry. Yep, and we got ours on Amazon. I think Michaels has them, Walmart has them online, but it's cheaper to buy to Amazon than at Michaels because they don't give you, they don't um, take coupons on their books. Okay, I can ready for yellow now. It's looking rather good, if I must say so. <laughs> they look so weird in the beginning, but they turn out so cool by the end. Yeah. Oh yeah, and then yeah, anyone I You can move yours down a little bit in your picture. Oh darn it. I keep doing that. Um, 
So if anyone who plays along, just do the, um, like Debbie said, hashtag. Yeah, my paint's lumpy. It's going icky. It happens when you don't use it. Hashtag fib paint along. And then on Instagram, you can see everybody's stuff. It's if fib, fib paint too. along. Yeah. Damn, so messy. Paint on my arms. Hi, Vicky. Vicky's here. Hi, Vicky. Any any loving suggestions? Kimberly said, <laughs> Joyce said, Kimberly, I need a brown sack for my llama. <laughs> you need a feed sack? So what does the llama eat? Grass? Grass eater? Yeah, I would say grass. You would say grass? Hey, maybe some grain. Are they are they like uh, goats? Do they eat a variety of things? Trees, limbs, and so I was wondering.
Maybe this one won't need any dental work. Hmm. Mine's got some teeth showing. He does? <laughs> okay, mine's. Yeah. Herber roses, so just grass. They like grass. Oh. Do I need to put some grass coming out of his mouth? <laughs> <laughs> he might need a cow. Yeah, is he gonna have any accessories like you know a hat? Maybe? These little those they wear these little bells. Tibetan Tibet bells or something. I'll have to Google that. <laughs> Can't believe he's working through the uglies. quicker if you get the base down I think it's gonna go quicker if you get the first like initial colors down you know what I mean I think it's gonna go faster after that I am loving all these pretty pastels the purple and greens and So cheerful. Okay. <laughs> said you don't know ugly. <laughs> Okay, I gotta fix his lip. Get a little messy with the blue.
I guess the other little kitties uh, got hit by a car, I think, Shauna. I don't know if it's an indoor or outdoor kitty. Um, I had to get surgery today, and I think surgery tomorrow. So I think she just she's uh, said she's just too unglued. Else she probably would have been joining us. Wow. I don't know if he's an indoor or outdoor. I mean, I don't know. Who was that? Lena. Oh, Lena. Yeah. Yeah, he said that their little kitty got must have got hit and then it dragged itself back to her. It took her three days to get its way back to her. And then it's gone through one surgery and it's gonna go through another surgery. And that a heartbreaking the little thing had the strength to, to take it three days, but it didn't quit until it got home. And so it's going to have to get surgery, another surgery tomorrow on his leg. Just heart wrenching. A strong little baby. They're fragile. They sure are. All right. Right, cat. So she was drug herself home, took her three days, and she got home, and now she's getting the, they're getting her the care she needs, and so I'm going to pray for her little kitty gets through tonight, and all the little surgeries, and is, is okay. Lena's such a kind person, too. She's got to be, and she's just I think a really sensitive person anyway. Yeah. I know I would be not dealing with that. I know I am too. Uh -huh. Tender hearted. Mm-hmm. <laughs> He's looking a little wee bit funky, but it's going to get better. <laughs> My llama's looking a little funky. Okay. I, I like this area. Hopefully this area gets better. I don't like that eye area. Hopefully that gets better. Okay. I've kind of done some of this and some of this. So I did the background. Look in the color values and the light values. It almost looks like I need to add a little black around his ears, around his eyes, around his neck now. Yeah, she definitely uses black and white. They let her outside? Okay. Oh, Oh, an alpaca blanket. Oh, on his neck. Oh, that would be cute, Debbie. That would be so cute. Oh, I love that idea. And his straw hat. I wonder if I can actually do that. <laughs> All right, I got the Google alpaca blanket. Mostly cheese and yeah. what you eat. I could have all that. Not bad, isn't mm -hmm. it?
So I keep moving off camera. I'm trying to look at the book while I'm working. I need to peek at the book. <laughs> Got to peek. Ham, pepperonis, everywhere. Full pepper, full pepperonis. Sort of squared with. Spice. My my llama's going to be Llama Larry. Llama Larry. Yeah, yeah. Larry Llama. The Raven Llama hair. Oh my. The Llama hair blanket. I didn't know that. The book. Oh. I'm getting there. Yeah. I'd say he's probably got rid of all his llamas now. You think he has? Probably so. Even then again, he might. Be. He, he was making money. They were of pets, them. but he liked them as pets. Get attached. Oh. Gonna go okay. Here, I'll put this right here. The rest of it. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Around the eyes. Okay. That's what I thought. Now I just gotta go back in the nostrils. I like the blanket idea, Debbie. Over his shoulder. Do they have earrings? Oh, earrings. Yeah, I'm on, um, actually, I'm on step three. Almost into step four. I'm just doing a few more touch of uh, the black on step three, Mindy. Putting some black um, highlights on his neck, his nose, his ears, and around his eyes. Okay, now I'm on step four. Step four is basically going in and making the pinks darker, purples darker, basically everything darker, the yellow darker, the pink, yeah, just darkening up what's here. And then um, it shows here, she chooses red tent medium tones, dull yellow, orange, lighter tone, direction line. So she big brush strokes on the side in the direction of its hair. That makes sense. Now we're only doing it on this side and not this side. Okay. Ugh, I moved my drink. Y'all know how many times I've almost dunked my brush and my drink. You don't want to know. 
<laughs> I did that once. I keep putting my cup too close. <laughs> the Dr. Pepper. So we have Dr. Pepper painting stuff. I got. That's okay, Dot. You don't talk much anyway. <laughs> Did you order this book? Ugh. Purple's all clogged up. Darn it. I will say the nice thing about these, I'm using a lot of um, a lot of different paints that were sitting, you know what I mean? Ugh. See, they yeah. set it, they goopy, get yucky, they separate. <sighs> so it's like, you know, making something awesome and using those paints. Just doing something different. It's just a, it's different from all my other junk journals and gluing just my glue papers and yes, exactly, Debbie. Using up some of those acrylics. I still like to do my art prompts. <laughs> oh, I love doing the prompts. I mean, I love doing that too. But it's also nice just just to paint too and uh, keep all of your skills fresh. You know, and then the fox we're going to do, the fox on here is a combination of the two in the back with the, um, doing the hair, the, the hair, the, the paper background and the, along with the painting. Yes. So that's going to be pulling all of our like art journal skills and painting skills together. It, we, I want to do. I want to do it in black to make it look like Abby. Oh, black and blue. Yeah. Debbie said to use. I could do blues because she's all black. going out of the lines. My llama's neck keeps getting fatter and fatter and fatter. I painted an apple that was similar. Um, what you doing? It is. Like some Thank blue you. to get the dark highlights. <laughs> what does it look like? Your nose is crooked. I have a crooked nose. Well, your lip. <laughs> Well, he's wiggling his lips. He's getting ready to spit, ain't he? He's getting ready to spit at you. I know. That's <laughs> they don't like you. You're in trouble. He's going to slap If they like you. He's going to so, spit at you. <laughs> Look out, Joe. Better watch it. It's okay, honey. I know you got one cross-eyed. Uh, <laughs> I'm not finished. Let me finish. Oh, my goodness. You know I used to be a judge. You did? Mm -hmm. What did you judge in? I judged everything I looked at. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me that you. 
Era a Karina de Ed. <risos> Here comes the judge. Here comes the judge. I'd rather have you than Judge Judy. Oh Larry the Lama is a rapper. Oh, <laughs> I'll tell you what. They need Judge Judy down there in Miami. Two little boys got left in the daycare van and died. Oh, that is just so uncalled they, for. I, I hate, you know, oh my. That was their job. I don't know. So sad. It's terrible. It's just unexcusable. How did they do that? How did they forget children in the van? Left them in the. Well, the other day, guy left left this kid in the car, and uh, he went to work, and forgot the kid was in the back, How, for eight for eight hours. How could you possibly even forget that? That's what they all say, and I, I not I yeah. don't I don't buy it. Oh, it just doesn't make any well, sense. I can understand you accidentally locking your kids in the car for a couple hours, but not leaving them. <laughs> and the only reason why I can understand that is because I did it. But yeah, as I say, I, I can say I never left my kids in a car. Would they even considered it? I mean, it's just like they're there. You just. Yeah, I don't understand that now. I get angry just if I go out and see if someone's left their dog out in the car. I'm stood there just to see if they see how long they're in there and come out. So sorry for that Pink Panther, <laughs> don't give up. Don't give up. It's going to be good when you get done. Start in my pink. Oh, that's a good. You taking pictures of each step, so that way you. How does it look, Joe? Process. That's a good idea. It's a lot better.
Yeah, because no one, you know, just by looking at the finished product, no one knows like how much, you, you know, I mean, how many layers went into it and how much work and yeah. Good idea. Goodness. Yeah, there's a lot of people that wear the fake eyelashes and um they're kind of, I mean they look good, but they're kind of expensive. Like it's very like, popular. It's like the, the fingernails. I mean, your lash is gonna grow, they're gonna need touched up. Oh, there is. Can Do you, me a favor. Can you yeah. yeah. What? Go in there in that um that blue tub in our bedroom there by the door, there is a pair of fake eyelashes in that box. Oh, that would be <laughs> give me a llama. <laughs> there you go. I threw eyelashes on her. We're going to try. Yes, put some eyelashes on her. I love it. I see this. That's what I like about this stuff. When you get to do the details later. <laughs> it's 40 minutes on surgery. One of them to remove. They refuse today. Yeah. That's, I don't understand that. Makes sense. They, they need those off when they're doing the surgery. It does make sense. They're going to be in the way. They had to shake, get her eyelashes off. In the bottom or the yeah. blue one, in that blue box that you have in your hand. My nephew had the eye lens correction, and uh, he he ended up getting an eyelash underneath the new lens and they had to had to go back in like two days later and they had to go in and get it out oh. i know it was just a freak uh, thing yeah this pet i can't miss them honey But he didn't have to wear glasses anymore. Well, I've got one. You want me to kill it? What's that, baby? They're making contact lenses now. You don't have to scream. One's uh, for far away, far away for looking at things far away. Right. And the other thing is for looking up things reading close. i know yeah yeah, yeah well, been it's not close right you blink your eyes one time right and then it'd be like a reader's glasses and if you want to see something far away you blink them twice and look like binoculars oh okay wow. but they had they do that honey one close and one far away they do that my glasses are I heard it way. today on the radio out okay there. okay my husband has. I don't, know, I don't, know, about the, I don't okay. know about the blinking part, but I know he has contacts with one close up and one uh, far away. I don't know how. It's a joke. It was a joke. It is? Oh, I don't get it. Sorry. You say he actually has a contact. It's one that's close up. Blinking one. part, yeah. <sighs> Over my head. You can see him. Okay. The air conditioner or jet? Yeah. 
Feels good. Wow, eleven thousand dollars. We did a picture, see if I can find it. Oh, he gave it a heart nose. How cute. Oh, little heart nose and lashes, little doodles. Oh, that's so cute. I love the little twist you put on it, Kimberly. Oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that hurt those. It's awesome. You think it's funny? I think it's adorable. I love the little scribbles too on his head. Put some. Really super creative. I like the twist she puts on everything. Joycey, she had a really different one too. She put a it's twist on her. So what might be in the other box? Oh my gosh, these teeth, they're going to scare me to death to do teeth. You know, if I'm looking forward to the teeth. Okay. It's cold. She said it was a day day. your cowbell Beth you were looking for no I never did find it oh I quit looking bummer first thing when you know you have it somewhere I just ran out of time yeah yeah you'll find it when you're not looking for it <laughs> That's how it always works. <laughs> yeah. You'll be like, there it is. Dang, nub it. <laughs> Hi, Eileen. Welcome. Could be another one. It's Kathy. She ditched us so for dinner with her husband. So it's just the two of us. <laughs> I feel you should be coming home pretty soon. Now she's going to owe us a llama.
You ought to tweet or go ahead and tweet or your llama. You find him? Uh, you owe us a llama, girly. Uh, Wish you were here. Yeah, Kathy's fun, too. What do you think? <laughs> it's laying down there on top of it. I don't like the color of his nose. Did you see Kimberly's um, what she just tweeted Eileen, her version? She gave her little llama a little heart nose. No, I didn't see it. Yeah, she tweeted a picture. It's adorable. Ooh. I'll have to see if I can. I'm not going to put them on yet. I'm going to wait and do it last. Oh, teeth. What there. do you think, Colleen? <laughs> oh, yeah. got to have some lash. I have lashed. I lashed everything this year. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta paint some more. I haven't seen it yet. Put a little eyeshadow on it. <sighs> oh, jeez, scary. Okay, zero nine. Did she go back out? No, she went out when I took her. So you will go out back this time. You finish with this, honey. I mean, I don't fuck them with you. Right? They're the best. Come on, let's go out. We talked about how awesome uh, dollar store eyelashes are. This focus. All right. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> I don't like doing his mouth. This is terrible. This is terrible. It's like he's got fangs. I knew this is going to be the worst part. I don't do well with mouths. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, let's go. We need oh, yeah, a little whatever these are. Little hairs. Okay. There's some little hairs here. That's my missing. Yeah, any white around his eyeballs. Okay. That made like really human looking eyeballs. Is that Brenda that did made hers? Her um how? 
I had very Debbie's few. eyes were really good. So I was thinking Brenda had she really. Had, you could see the whites in her eyes. Brenda's on uh, Instagram, but it seems like hers are pretty human. They look good too. Thanks, Cheryl. Do you look like he's surprised? <laughs> Happy, surprised, same thing. <laughs> you found what in Tuesday mornings? Oh. All right. Red. Hi, Azure. Okay, Cindy said she just posted Lucille to the group page. She has a neck bow and a nose pearl. <laughs> a nose pearl. Aw. Is that uh, Aww. is that on um Beth's page? Beth's Facebook page. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see the nose pearl. <laughs> Blue says, what do my eyes are seeing up here? That's awesome. Kind of fun, I can't huh? wait to see it, Cindy. It sounds so cool. She's liking this. You already finished yours, so we must be slow pokes. Didn't Cindy start after us? <laughs> I don't <Yeah>. know. <laughs> We've been at it since six o'clock. <laughs> We're on the home I think I started. Though. Well, we did have some issues in the beginning with technical stuff. So that doesn't count. We weren't when we yeah. were meeting then. That doesn't that don't count against I us. I still don't know how to do it. I don't know what I get we'll have to wait till the Actually I know what to well, do. there'll be a video out real soon and it'll say Stream Yard for Dummies. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> And I will watch it. Now you did good. You did fine. I actually, the trouble I have is when I finish that when you leave, there's an exit button at the top right hand corner. You have to hit that else it still stays live on YouTube. It took me 12 minutes of figuring that out. And I just got my daughter to oh. eliminate that off my video. Yeah, it's like the top right hand corner when you exit the. When we end this thing and debbie typed that in and i i don't know why i didn't register me she was talking to kathy it actually applied to me too and my video kept playing but i couldn't get to stop and so yeah i had to go into the stream yard to get it to stop That's your excuse. I think you would put your own flair on it anyway. Both of you. It just shows. I think it's. I think it's awesome. Be brave and to to brave enough to put your own like flair into it. And I love that everybody's playing along and trying because uh, that's 
stuff to have fun and art, you know? You don't know if you love it till you yeah. try it. You know? You don't know. And you have it to is. have you do. You have to have you know wins and loses and also, you know, good stuff, bad stuff to grow. I've thrown so many things away it isn't even funny. So I'm like, yeah, no. I liked in a Barb uh a Barb stream, Barb Owen, she was like, Yeah, I throw them in the trash cans and then I pull them back out. <laughs> she said, but it's something it feels good to throw them in a trash can. <laughs> and I'm like, Yep. Oh. It sure does. It's just something therapeutic about throwing it in the trash can. So if she pulls hers back out, I don't know. Uh, well, Barb, point. she's she's taught me how to journal you journal on a page and you write down uh you write down anything you want no matter how nasty it is and then you paint black over it and then you paint a picture it's kind of like a venting thing yes yeah you're letting it out but no one else reads it Therapeutic. Right. All right. So I'm coming along. It's got some more white highlights to go. Ooh, I tell you what, that purple is like bam in your face. Woo wee. Okay, now let's see here. Are you leaving? Oh, I'm glad you played along. Thank you, Cindy. I'm going to check it out later. I'm getting there. Glad you have fun. I can make these little stripey things a little more. I guess you should have a smaller brush. Hers are much more tiny and subtle. So, Debbie, what color is your llama going to be? You going to rebel and do different color or you going to do the same colors? You going to do the pinks and purples or you think you'll do a different color all together? I liked your blue cow. Different for sure. Okay. Yeah, I like the I like that uh, Kimberly does a and her are a very subtle she likes softer, um, at least the past few things she's done is a softer tone. So she well, I'm kind of happy with his yeah. neck. Let's see. Let's more yellow. Let me 
need some more pink for hair. Oh, you do? That's nice, Mendy. <laughs> oh my gosh well she had paint on the book and I just added to it I'm painting on the book and that talented I am Debbie do you have any suggestions for me <laughs> oh gosh I've officially broke my book and I've got paint all over it <laughs> Loving suggestions. I still got to do my background. Maybe I better quit and do it for a little while. You can do that. Let it dry. That way it's drying. <laughs> I got red I paint off for my book. I'll be like, what's real? What's what did she do and what did I do? <laughs> that red paint all over my book. Oh my gosh. So, so I got out of my notebook. Then I got all my books, but just swap. Okay. All right. I gotta go back in with the pink now. Not clean up my mess. I <laughs> know, <laughs> right? The one on the right is Colleen's camel or llama, and she, uh, Azure wants you to put a hat on him and give him a cocktail. <laughs> <laughs> give him a cocktail. What kind of cocktail? I don't drink. You'll have to help me out. <laughs> Something fun and fruity, huh? <laughs> With an umbrella in it, I guess. <laughs> A faux drink. <laughs> A hat can be fun. She said a flux drink. Mini a mini pearl, pearl hat. I almost go and say, what? Let's see if you highlight. Ooh, I've got the other color in it. What some grass in his mouth, Joycey? <laughs> with grass. A drink with some grass in it would be cute. Hmm, that would be cute. I like that. Let's see, I think. I think I'm done, I think. Let me double check it. The celery in it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Light pink, purple, blue, pink, yellow. Double checking what she did.
a bit more yellow here. There's not a lot of instruction with this book. It is definitely a lot of just looking at the pictures and just just doing what she did. Which I'm not, I'm okay with that. So thanks, Janet. They're happy llamas. <laughs> right, Beth? Anyone see Packer dies? <laughs> happy go lucky. Where she posted a, a, a picture of she found the, uh, the sun visor. with him on it and he's sitting there at the steering wheel in the car super cute oh, that would be cute a sun visor on him a golf hat oh a sun visor that's a good idea Bob Ross, that was it. Thank you. I totally had a a brain freeze. Yeah, she had a Bob Ross, um, like a, a sun thing for your car. She found that store and then showed a picture of it in her car. Oh my God, it's hilarious. Because he's sitting there with the steering wheel, like it looks like he's driving your car. I'm like, I I want one of those. If I find one, <laughs> he's mine. Oh my gosh. Yeah, Janet saw it. She knows what I'm talking about. Yeah. Sun blocker. Yeah. Um, Larry the llama caddy. Oh, the sun blocker. Sun blo okay, I know what you mean now. I love all your all's ideas. Larry the Llama. Lloyd, my uh, Tom suggested, uh, he suggested Lloyd the Llama because it's, you know, LL. That's the name he suggested. I'm like, I don't know if I want to have a boy one or not. So I don't think there'd be too many because the colors, it, it says more girl to me. Sorry, I'm off camera again looking at the book. Just double checking if I missed anything. That looks good. That looks good. Let's see. This nose is a little dark. Yeah, I made him a humongo nose. <laughs> sort of like the chicken head I was trying to make. Oh my gosh. I'll show you all my paint, my, my chicken sketch when I'm done. 
And if you notice in this book, she has the rooster. I'm still saying chicken. It's a rooster. There's a rooster painting in here. But on another page, she actually in this book shows another. She shows a chicken in here. Okay. But doesn't show the process of how to make the chicken though. So you tell us that just kind of look at the chicken and just go with it. Like I think I like the chicken as much as the roosters in there. Oh yeah, there is another one. Yeah, but yeah, but it doesn't have a tutorial. Oh, okay. And I think that we could we could probably still do it because we just gotta look at the picture now. We know we've done a couple of these now. And get put okay. Amazing. Lashes. I'm done. Let's see. I need my I need my marker. I don't want to try to do it with a brush. Excuse me. The chicken looks random layers and markers and then background creates the chicken shapes. Let me look at that. Let's see what she's saying. Ah, blame my pain I got on my book. <laughs> okay, let's see. Okay, so here's the rooster that I sketched out. And that's the D step by step. There, but there's the chicken. Oh, I see. Here's the chicken that is not in the step by step that I really like. Random paint layers and markers, and then the background creates the chicken shapes. Uh huh. Random background layers. So you're saying she did this first and then did the chicken on top? She did the, all this first? Bye, Cheryl. Thanks for coming. I bumped up too far again. Darn it. Um, okay, so I want to make this one. I really like the colors of this chicken. I want to make this one because yeah, I like the greens. Uh, the turquoises, the uh, you know, little pops of red, the little turk. I like it because it's a lot of turquoise, which I love. Turquoise legs. Still off camera. God. Can I get used to this? Okay. That would be good. There's no instructions for it. We're just going to be looking at it and doing it. But I really like, I think. I no, really we could like probably that. put it on Twitter. Which are we doing next, the fox or the chicken? You can write on paint and the chicken and then went over with paint on the background. I think we're going to do the random chicken. The chicken without instructions. You can wing it. Debbie, Debbie <laughs> wants to do it. Yeah. Debbie wants to do it on a Friday. <laughs> you can wing it. <laughs> wing it. If I can only be so witty, I'd be dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> we won't be chicken. <laughs> <laughs> 
Michelle will be thinking about it. She's going to do it. <laughs> we won't be chicken. Now, let's see. It doesn't have the chicken butt in it. So are we going to, like, chop off the butt, like, in the picture? Or are we going to make it have a chicken butt? It says in the rear end, like, it was cut off. So we can have it going to the edge of the page or make a chicken rear. <laughs> Yeah, this one I do. I love the colors. I'm in love with the colors. It's just this non traditional, more um, contemporary. I think it's more contemporary. And that makes it fun. Oh, that'd be good, Debbie. Debbie said she's going to make a sketch. We can use Wednesday. And pay and pay and post it. Okay, she might make a she might make a, a, a sketch of it tomorrow and post it. All right, sounds good to me because I like this chicken. Oh, it might be a rooster. It has the red thing on it. Is it considered a rooster because it has the red thing on the top? Or do chickens have it? Maybe it's a rooster, but it's just like a non because it doesn't. Oh, make it. Going. <laughs> Let's see the lashes. Our children will have a butt. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh, that's perfect. Yes, it looks like he's looking, like she's looking down. Oh my gosh, let me see your teeth. Your teeth look fantastic, by the way. I copied the teeth out of the book. I think your teeth look more real. You see his teeth? Yeah, your teeth look a little more like real. Yeah, teeth. she's batting her ass. I think he, that, these are really good. Those look like people teeth. That was really good. <laughs> I put a tongue. Oh, I put a tongue in there too. <laughs> you see your tongue, but not children. <laughs> Her tongue. She's got a little tongue. Oh lordy. You did great. I love it. I love it, Beth. It only took us two hours or something like that. <laughs> I still like to work on our eyes. I'm going to work on our eyes a minute. Oh, yeah. You gave her a tongue. Oh, my gosh. Look at her teeth and tongue. <laughs> I want to, I'd like to get her eyes a little bigger. <laughs> Look at that. She gave her tongue and teeth. <laughs> okay, what did you say in Llama's War? Uh, some sort of... Try to find some llama photos. Like next thing, what do they wear? Cows wear bells. What kind of blanket. Yeah. Oh, that was it. The blanket. Poncho or something. Llama blanket. Let me Google that. Llama blanket. Let's see. What about this? Little tassels. They have like a little headdress with tassels mm -hmm. and bells. Well, hello. How are you? Who are you talking to? You. Yeah. Fresh coffee. Unless you want to pour it in here. It's pretty hot. 
So be careful. I keep seeing his images of llamas on blankets. Oh, I'm Googling the right thing. Llama. Hair blank. Was it she said hair? I'm like looking in the wrong place. Alpaca blanket. Ugh. <laughs> Yours looks like Scooby Doo, Joycey. <laughs> Alpaca blanket. Thank you. Well, I don't see anything. Alpaca. All right. Alpaca. Alpaca spit. <laughs> I came up. Okay. So it looks okay. See you know how to do images? <clears throat> yes. But I was keying in the wrong words. So I was getting blankets. You know how to do images? Oh. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Says so some fringe on it, stripes, if you want. Okay. Over the shoulder. Okay, I see what she's talking about now. Pencil at. All right, Joycey, I want to see your Scooby Doo. How would I do that? He doesn't have any shoulders. Scarf. They've got, um, what, what's it called? The front teeth that has a space in the middle. The two front teeth that have the space in the middle. Oh, the. They've got those kind of teeth. Here's what I was thinking of. I'll put a tassel in his ear. I'll make a tassel. No, a square base at the neck. do one that would be neat to do but I don't know how to do it. It's all scarf. <laughs> Tassels on his ears. What is that a llama? Okay. Curve across the neck. I'm just gonna make a little tassel. I can make a tassel. Straight out to the side. Curve across his neck. Out to his side. Okay. 
What are you going to do, Beth? I'm sorry. I'm going to make a tassel and hang it from his ear. <laughs> I have, I have tassels. <laughs> like this <laughs> there you go this would stick out really bad in a book I'm hanging off his sweater so it's hanging out the bottom of the book I could do that would be fun to do if we gave a thing like outside yeah, there you go so big it would, the book wouldn't close with this base or if I could pull this off and just off and just steal that part of it check out twitter for pictures okay i like it i see genies Oh, well, I wasn't getting that at all. That's nothing like I drew. Okay. <laughs> okay. Something like that. Now she sort of has them outlined completely in white. Did you notice that? No, I did not. Oh, she did outline them in the light. After the game this far, I decided to add mint green to the background. The all greens weren't working. Okay, she said she put white outline around him for an illustrative look. So she did that for an illustrative look, she said. Wow. Oh. Good eye. You see that. 
Matt need, yeah, I agree, because it's not going to work over top this Okay. Piece. I would agree with that. <laughs> Are you getting your tassels ready? Are you going to take and um, wait? Oh, you're still painting. I see it now. You're outlining it. Okay. Yeah. No, I'm going to get them ready right now. I just, I uh, just need to wait. I'm glad you point that out. I've got to. That's even wrote on there and it is for it. that too. Then she went over with little hairs over top of the, the white. Okay. Well, now we can sing. Instead of she's got flowers in her hair, hair we got tassels in his ears. One side's more fanny, the other side's more straight. Okay. I like it. I'm pretty happy with it. He's cute. That's fun to do. Now a whole little book of animals. Our journal of animals. If you wanted to, you could do these on canvases, hang it up, leave it in a journal, kind of whatever, whatever, whatever you want to do. You could put it in a journal and then frame it later if you changed your mind. Sorry, I keep going off camera. Yeah. It's easier to do some of these highlights up close. Hey, we both did good. We didn't break out the dryer once. So if you just keep if you just keep going. Yeah, I mean, like you can try to, you know, do one section and I'm about ready to on these eyes. <laughs> then you won't have to uh, use the dryer as much. Put paint on them. So yeah, you act enough. It was dry enough to do these little feathery hair marks now. Especially with doing this, I didn't want to, like, Run the dryer, blast you out. So, Joycey um, is going to eat dinner and she's going to finish hers. 
Jeannie posted a picture of her progress. I see Cindy posted hers on the page. Chuckle, I thought yours looked good. There's nothing to chuckle about. I liked it. Nothing wrong with it at all. You look good, Jeannie. That perfectionist that critic, you know, I do the same thing. It's like I criticize myself and then it's like I shouldn't do that. You shouldn't do that. You did good. It's good. As I was to say, I don't know if mine looks I mean everyone's is different too, so these are all, you know, if they had a pattern, it, we could do that. But even if we had a sketchy pattern, it'd still all be different to a degree. I like, I like Jeannie's. Beth will like it too. It's fun to have a, a group thing to play along, uh, to do something that we're all doing the same thing together. I think it's fun. It's something we haven't really done before. I mean, we've all worked out of the, I guess, the one watercolor book a little bit, but I don't know if we ever really did. Like, oh, I love it. Yeah. I don't know if we've ever done this. This might be a first kind of I group. think it's wonderful. Fib, fib group, whatever. Okay, see the finished one. Okay. The one I saw before was not finished. Okay. Oh, look at that. Look at the teeth. Oh, my gosh. The teeth. The teeth are really good. Oh, I'm not good. I did her, her mouth like hers. I could not. I didn't tip teeth. She did the teeth Show with the teeth. gap. She did the teeth with a gap like you were saying. That looks so good. It looks good, Jeannie. I like it. You did good. She did the teeth gap thing. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, I think they should. She did do that. It looks good. Is it on your phone? It's on Twitter. Yeah, I could bring it up on my phone and show them. That's a good idea. All right. Okay, I mean it. I love all. I love everything. I love. I love it. Let's see if it take. I'll hold it here that shows up on YouTube. I can move it. Wow, there's such a lag. Okay. Still oh. holding it. She's got depth in, in the cheek part. Yeah. I don't have that kind of depth. It is cute. It's very cute it's there. Here. She did good. This little. Yeah, it's easy. yeah, this say to participate, you know, it's hard to do. And she didn't have a book either. She's just going by, she's just going by what, you know, by what we're doing and looking at the picture. So that's even harder. So kudos. It's awesome. I mean, I got to, I got to show Kimberly. Kimberly finished hers like hours ago too. <laughs> hours ago. Absolutely. She's fast too. Where's that? Where is it at? It's out. Did you post that at? Here it is. She had to get her pajamas on for the llama party. <laughs> oh, 
Very cute with the little heart nose. I love it. It's neat, isn't it? Seeing everybody's take on what they're on their on it. I love it. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It is. Look, it, it, it's so cute, too. I love it. It's so different. It's encouraging for everybody to see, like, the, everybody's version of it, too. So you'd be like, hey, I can do that, you know? There's no painty police. It'd be on, uh, get your iPad, go online. You need to call her? Yeah. I'm, call I'm, him? Paul's not going. Online. Okay. That's right. No judgment. That's right. And I think it's encouraging to everybody who's who's brave enough to do this with us to show their work and and uh, inspire inspire others. You know, if you want to have fun and that and learn, you want to inspire others. That's part of the awesomeness. So, to say, hey, I can do this. That's so why I feel good about this book. It's made me feel good about myself. Yes, absolutely. The colors are fun and cheerful to make you smile just looking at the llama. And uh, when you look at the look at what we've done, they just so cute. They just make you smile. Yes, they are. You look at these, and and like, just makes you smile. All right. What else am I doing? Here's my eraser. Happy little llama. Huh? <laughs> it's a happy little llama. He's a happy llama. He was his happy trees. Yep. Well, we have a, a laughing cow and a happy cow. So we have, you know, we have happy llamas now. These colors are just so fun. I would have never done like a llama and be, like if I was going to do one, I would have going to like a, a page and made them you know real and not done all this fun play oh the chicken we're gonna do the chicken next who doesn't want to have a turquoise purple chicken? <laughs> turquoise and green chicken i'm gonna have the funnest zoo in town <laughs> our farm yeah. right there once or the farm to see my colorful, uh, my colorful animals. Yeah, we're 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 painting a zoo. We're painting a colorful zoo. Yes, like people are gonna be like, yeah, we're coming to a zoo. There's purple llamas, pink cows, turquoise chickens. <laughs> Sign me up. Oh, you're welcome, Dot. Yeah, we're finishing up. They've never been to our zoo, have they? Huh? I'm gonna skip the. I'm gonna skip the. Whatever the jacket. I think it's too much, too complicated for me. The llama coat.
Debbie will make hers a llama coat, and then I'll have a, then I can copy. <laughs> I do need a name, though. I got to give my llama a name. Was it, yeah, Lloyd, uh, what are the other names? You need a bigger paint palette. It's a funny farm. Lloyd is good. I can just use half of these. <laughs> what was that movie? We bought a zoo. <laughs> well, we painted one. <laughs> we painted this even zoo. better. Even better. My fabric blue. Hi, Patricia. Okay. I did an update. I did an update on his teeth. Okay. Here. Look at here, Colleen. All right. Oh, my God. She gave him buck teeth. He matches my cow. And buck teeth. <laughs> really good you get you get skill with painting teeth oh my gosh <laughs> it gives us such character doesn't it sorry you pounding i'm trying to get my fabric glue to come out of the bottle oh my god that gives that guy so much character our girl yeah Oh, she likes that. Oh, Mitzi said she's going to copy your llama's teeth. She likes his teeth. Okay. I won't care. Good. But that's what they look like. <laughs> they really look like that. There. Make tassels. I had to make tassels smaller. I would not have been able to close my book. I'm off camera again. I've done it all night. All right, bye, Jeannie. Thank you. I'm glad you participated. Love you, Llama. Remember, hashtag Fibs Paint Along if you post it on Instagram. So it all go in the same thing, same hashtag. Everybody can find them all. Love you, Llama. <laughs> Love you, Llama. <laughs> hug a llama. How about the hug a llama today? Is there a llama quote? Chicken sketched and butt added. <laughs> All right, we have a we have a chicken with a butt. All right. <laughs> That's great, Randy. <laughs> okay, let's see. Llama, the yeah, llama quote. Mama llama ain't got time. Be like a llama. No prob llama. No drama, llama.
Save the drama for the llama. Rock is drama llama. Llama is a spirit animal. Oh, <laughs> true. <laughs> Okay, now here's the final touch. Oh, you are amazing. <laughs> You're a llama amazing. Oh my gosh, here's one. Spit happens. <laughs> Spit happens. Amazing. Be wild. No drama, llama. I like spit happens. Oh, I love it. It seems to be the common ones. No drama, llama. No problem, llama. Love is drunk. Uh, llama is love. Oh, my gosh. Colleen. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Let's see. Oh my. Okay. It's gonna post another. See the eyelashes? I got them flipped up. I love spit happens. Yeah. Now she looks wide awake. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> the teeth. The eyes are much better. Yeah, I like it. Oh my God, this teeth. Have you ever drawn teeth before? Hello, lover. <laughs> that would be no. <laughs> so you did really good. Either. <laughs> huh? I've never done any kind of art before. But look at that. I'm telling you, it looks like you've done teeth before. Isn't she beautiful? Okay, now I need a llama name. Llama name. Google has everything. Colleen, what time on Friday? A lazy. She's a lazy <laughs> llama. Um, so you wanted to, so we don't overlap with with Mary. Um, do you want to, let's see, would it take us to do this? Three hours? So do you want to come on about five o'clock? So that way, then we'll be done by eight o'clock or so or eight thirty before she could when she comes on. So you do five Eastern. 
that gives us three and a half hours to finish to do this before Mary comes on. Uh, depending on how many people you want, you know, on, I'll do it. If, if you know, if your others want to do it, that's fine too. But I can do it too, either way. Okay. Debbie way. said she needs it to be five thirty. Okay, so 5.30 Eastern. Okay, and then it gives us three hours to get it done. I, I think we'll have a fair amount of people, 5.30. More will yep, come in later, work. but we'll still be working on it. And if they come in at, if they come in at 6.30 or whatever, we'll still be working on it anyway. Yeah. Okay, so Debbie's going to be well, me, you, I'll and Debbie, and maybe Kathy making the chicken. There'll be four of us. There's just so many of us now. It's going to be, it's hard to, you know. Yeah, uh, say, well, okay. Well, I can, Debbie can, and if you can, we'll do chicken. We'll have at least three, and then we'll see if Kathy can. And then we're, she's posting a picture. I'll share it on um, her, her sketch on um, your Facebook, too, so people can see it there. And then Twitter, and then um, we could post on Instagram, too. So everybody knows about it and can have time to, to draw it. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I did this. Yeah, too many is hard to see. I think four would be good. A four split screen wouldn't be bad. Okay, Debbie said she'll post on Instagram and she'll post on Facebook. Oh, some great. And then Twitter, too. And then we should have everybody covered who follows in. That sounds good. We got a plan in the works. What are you, what are we doing now? What is that? Oh, okay. Oh, you put, oh, look at that. Yeah, I think we got we're doing something. I'm putting little eyelashes on the bottom with the fine liner. Did you get your eyelashes at the Dollar Tree? I know that's where I got mine out. That's where you get yours at or not. Well, not for this project, but for another project. Yeah. Yeah, and they even have like thick ones, thin ones. Make like three different ones, like thin, medium, and thick eyelashes at the Dollar Tree. Who told me that? Debbie. I think Debbie got me in going on that one. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's very big, good at drawing her eyes. Actually, <laughs> what so, she I mean, does on the bunnies are just so beautiful. I mean, uh, she was saying her chicken is big, but the but I think uh, picture's big. I think I'm good. <laughs> So, I mean, the picture is big. I mean, the picture is the same size as this book. Or here, this is the same size as the book. And it takes the whole thing up from the top to the bottom. And it's just space here and here. Yeah, that makes sense, Debbie. Because it does. 
Uh, and that's what I liked about it too. It's big, it's colorful. Wow. I'm excited about doing this. I'm going to put him in between my llama and my cow. I'm going to put him right there in between on my chicken right there. I have a whole book of these. I'm excited. think maybe our art will be famous someday <laughs> famous yes famous Some people will be be looking for the fib art just never know her original is no butt oh i see what you're saying so it has to be a little smaller to get the butt on yeah i've got an original fib art it's a cow <laughs> Right. I look like he's trying out for wool pole, probably. <laughs> you two pieces of regular paper. I'll show you my chicken I drew. My rooster. It's in the book because it's on the 11 by 14. Hold on. Spiral graph. <laughs> Rolls. Um, here it is. If it can fit on the screen. That's my rooster. Oh, nope, he's not. I'm off again. Ugh. There. It's my rooster. So I, I kept drawing his head huge. Oh, it's terrible. And then Tom, like, help me out. He's like, no, they have little heads. <laughs> so there's my rooster. Top to bottom. It doesn't really fit on my word, on my name blocks it. But that was, that's the rooster in her book I sketched out. I love our little books we made. I'm going to work on this one too. Embellishing it. Let's see that we made this out of a 12 by 12. Okay. Yeah. Everybody has them, right? Did you see all my thread? <laughs> Damn, that, this rooster took some time. I won't say it. This took me a long time to draw, especially since I'm an amateur at drawing. But hey, we gotta start somewhere. And it is for fun. So I picked up this the other day. Okay, 365 days of drawing so I can get like better at drawing. It's just like a little idea book. I did one. One was like um, each there's it's broke up into imagination, tutorial, relaxation, color therapy, and observation. And so each one's color coded. So I sketched some apples. This is just color in a rainbow. This was just be relaxing. And then I did a tree. That's what I've done so far. And then the next one is to draw like a statue that people are looking at, draw some leaves. So it's just little um, things just to get you doing a little something each day. Draw some birds out of these little. Um, Blobs, which is cute. Oh, yeah. Fun. 
and darken it tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. And so I thought Aww. this was, was be fun to uh, do. So can, it should, yeah, do it real fast. Yeah, just something, you know, so like if you have a day where you don't really feel like making an art journal page or, you know what I mean? You go in and go, I'm going to do one thing in this book, you know what I mean? And, um, you know, draw something that makes you happy. Create a pattern. Use some, it's just ideas. It's just simple ideas. And it's, it, it's just to get the juices going, get you drawing. And I like it because it's not just drawing. It's like it's actually using watercolors and paints and drawing. Like it's everything combined. So I thought I found this there today. I thought it was cute. And uh, so if you're interested in having, like this one says color in the dots. This is just supposed to be relaxing like a, a mindless kind of meditative thing you know what i mean interlocking shape so i picked this up just to work on here and there and then i dug out my other book i bought a long time ago which i forgot about which oh, is okay which is this one which is uh wow. your beautiful ordinary life flow book and i bought this forever ago and Dee, Dee was showing um, how she cuts up her books and puts them in binders and stuff. And I remember it actually has this book. You know, it has the step-by-step -step how to draw the saucer. And you do it over here. I'm like, why have I not used this? So here's how to draw a three-dimensional house. You know, I mean, it's just really good. If you're good, if you're advanced at drawing, obviously this may not be for you. But if you're like me and you're new at it or a beginner, I think that this is really a fun way to kind of do this and not be nervous about drawing. So this is another one. So I'm going to work on, I'm going to kind of work on both here and there. This is fun. Draw a little shelf and decorate it. So yeah, you can use your markers, your watercolors. So yeah. And I've not, I've had this book probably a year and not done anything in it. And mainly because I forgot about it. It's terrible. So I'm going to keep these two out for when I just want to do a little something, something. And like maybe I'm watching it, like when I was watching the stream last night, I was working on this when I was watching Lisa. Oh my goodness. Yeah. And I mean, I think it's it's just like this this book has a ton, I just totally, this I forgot I owned. It's terrible, I hate that, I hate that. Where I forget about this I own. There you go. But yeah, so uh, this is something I want to do. I mean, I'm still going to do art journaling and painting and messy, messy journaling. I mean, I love all that. I love all art, but I also, um, this is has little tracing. And I'm sure I've, I'm sure we all can say that. This one has tracing paper in it, so you can uh, trace the lamps. And. Um, yeah, so this is uh, some cute stuff, and this is some cute stuff, and this will be fun if you're watching the stream or watching yeah, something. Yeah, pull this sucker out. This is like color, you know, take your pencils and color in these dogs. So, yeah, just in case anyone's looking for something different. Anyway, I love everything, so I love all, I love everything, so. So Thursday, Beth will do her oh, probably as, as tomorrow or assume tomorrow or Thursday she'll do her normal. Well, Colleen, I'm going to jump off here and uh, okie dokie. Yeah, tomorrow tomorrow Aunt Beck will be on at seven and she'll do a, a dirty dozen prompt game and then thursday i'm probably going to do a an art project and then i'll do another prompt game thursday sounds good and then friday we'll do a chicken <laughs> okay well thanks for streaming let me come in on your channel and stream i appreciate it it's been great. Yeah. Get your get your chicken hat out. 
Oh, so don't forget when you close stream. Well, thanks for helping me do it. I got to I need to. I do need to read about uh, how to do it better because I know there's. <laughs> Glad you have fun, Kimberly. Okay. See you all later. I'll click it off twice. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye, guys. <laughs> I know there's a lag. So we'll see y'all tomorrow somewhere else. <laughs> Good night.